Hello, have you come for story time? Well, today we're going to have a story about a dragon. Now, some dragons are very fierce, like this one is. That's a fierce dragon. Some dragons are only tiny like that. But the dragon I'm going to tell you a story about is a very small dragon called Shmogibogi. Can you say Shmogibogi? He's a very sad little baby dragon. Oh, that's a picture I drew of him. He's very sad. Would you like to know why he's sad? I'll tell you the story then. Now, all good stories start with once upon a time, don't they? So let's start off with once upon a time. Ready? Once upon a time, there was a tiny little baby dragon called Shmogibogi. He liked to watch the big dragons and try to copy what they did. He would wiggle his tail and flap his wings and try to fly a little bit. He was practicing his roar, but it still sounded a bit like Wah. But he couldn't breathe fire like the big dragons could. And he really wanted to do that. So that's why he was a little bit sad. Oh. He went to see the big friendly red dragon in his cave and asked him to show him how to breathe fire. The big friendly red dragon laughed and said, you're too small yet, Smorgy Borgy. You'll have to wait till you get bigger. So Smorgy Borgy walked slowly and sadly away with his wings drooping and his tail dragging on the ground. So then he went to see the big friendly blue dragon in his cave and asked him about breathing fire. The big friendly blue dragon also laughed and told Smorgy Borgy that he wasn't big enough to breathe fire yet. So Smorgy Borgy walked slowly and sadly away with his wings drooping and his tail dragging on the ground. Smorgy Borgy felt so sad that he was nearly crying. Oh. But he decided to try one more time. He remembered that there was a very old friendly silver dragon who lived in the nicest cave of all. So he went and asked him how to breathe fire. This time, the friendly old silver dragon said to him, Hmm, well, stand up straight. And let me see how big you are. Hmm, I think that you need to eat some of this to build you up and make you bigger. And the big old friendly silver dragon opened a tin and took out a piece of sticky cake and gave it to Smorgy Borgy, who went, trying to eat too much at once. So then he started to <coughs> coke, choke, <coughs> cough and choke, choke a bit <coughs> and suddenly had a huge sneeze. <coughs> and to his surprise, when he sneezed, fire shot out of his mouth. At last he could breathe fire like all the other dragons. Shmorgiborgi wagged his tail, flapped his wings and flew over to the other dragons. He perched on a big rock and tried his new roar and shot out a huge flame of fire. All the dragons roared with him and shot out fire. 
and everyone shouted, Hooray! 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 And they all lived happily ever after. That was the story of Smokey Bogey. Bye.